good start to the tournament. Uh, you must be happy with the form of some of your players. Yeah, we, we are happy with the win. I think it was a really important game for us to, to kick off this tournament in a positive note. And it was a tight one, and there was lots of pressure on, and, and the likes of Nathan McCullum really came through and was world class at the end there for us. And I think, you know, we've got lots of things to work on. We've got practice next couple of days, we've got practice prior to Zimbabwe. And, um, you know, that, they're not going to be easy either because they've just beaten Australia and Pakistan in a warm up game, so there's no easy game here. Uh, three wins on the trot, uh, a couple of tight ones, but the team's shown some uh, fighting spirit. Yeah, yeah, we're developing. Uh, we're trying to uh, work a method out to play on these surfaces. They're a bit slow and low and, and turning, and, and they're not easy um, you know, to score boundaries all the time. So it's really important uh, we come up with an effective method, and we've got a bit of work to do with the spin and playing of the spin. And I think Zimbabwe have got uh, plenty of that. So it's going to be really important that we uh, prepare properly in the next two days and get ourselves up to go again. And what sort of approach from the batsman? I think he'll be looking for you know, getting the ball on the into the outfield, you know, it's a nice big ground, big outfield, if we can get the ball in the outfield uh, and put pressure on the fielders, uh, we're going to pick up more runs like that. Um, and then what tends to happen then, if you can do that, you put pressure on the bowlers and then maybe you might get some more boundary op opportunities from that. Quite uh, well acquainted with some of the, the, the staff, the people involved in Zimbabwe cricket. Yeah, they, they've got a really good uh, management crew, uh, David Houghton's the high performance director, Heath Streak. One of their coaches, Alan Butcher from England, who's taken over. Um, so, you know, they've got some really good cricket brains. And um, I was talking to uh, Houts the other day, last night, and he's really excited about the, the, the developing group they've got of cricketers. So it's really good to see Zimbabwe back involved.